Are you proud to be an American? Yeah. Amen. Amen. We are doing something today that is national and historic, and I am very proud to be here with you. Well, really, the point of this uh, gathering today is to show our congressman, show our senator, um, really what we think back here in Shreveport. And we really just want them to, to get the message of what we think of these bailouts and the, uh, the huge debt that they're running up. Um, we're spending too much money as um, through the government, and uh, that, that spending turns into uh, much higher taxes. Not immediately, but over the next five to ten years, the spending that we're doing now is going to come to roost on our kids, and uh, we're trying to do my part to um, make more Americans aware of that. We absolutely have to quit punishing small businesses and medium-sized businesses with the kind of taxes and regulations we currently put on them. Medium and small-sized businesses are the job creators in this country. We cannot punish them or we'll ruin our economy. I'm tired of it all. I'm fed up. And uh, I just think that, that they're spending way too much money and they're shoving it through the Congress. Nobody's reading anything. Everybody's like frantically trying to convince us that this is in our best interest, but nobody really cares about our interest. And I'm tired of it. I'm out here because enough is enough is enough is enough and people aren't calling any of our our elected officials who by the way in case you've forgotten they work for us we pay their salaries our employees and they're treating us in an unconscionable manner okay the debt is is, is spiraling out of control it, it is out of control and they just seem to want more and more and more and enough is just enough stop get rid of the taxes and let people keep their money and actually use it if they used the money that they spent in all this bailout, and they could have paid off everybody's debt, and we'd be in great shape now. It's, they have some other plans with it. It's not to correct I don't anything. Plan to raise it hasn't corrected raise anything. Taxes. So it's, I don't see how they can go on any farther. We're, what, $12.8 billion, a trillion dollars in the hole now? My grandchildren owe 36 grand. I mean, come on, they're not even born yet. <laughs> it's just insane.